plantar warts. They're ugly. They're unsightly. They're hard to get rid of. Over-the-counter prescription uh, potions, old wives' tale, duct tape, seems to either take a long time or just not get rid of the uh, lesion at all. So some practitioners go to curatage, which is in essence removing or, or bluntly digging the uh, wart out, waiting for it to heal. Others will do excisional biopsies and suture the skin closed. I find that sometimes those are also lengthy in healing time and may cause scarring. Personally, I believe the quickest way to get rid of a plantar wart is cryoablation. And that involves liquid nitrogen, best performed in the office with one of the tanks where you can get the liquid nitrogen on a Q-tip or with one of the uh, professional spray dispensers. Sometimes the over-the-counter aerosol cans don't actually freeze it well enough. Now, when you're performing a cryoablation, the wart is like a iceberg. Here's the tip, and then as you go deeper down the tissues, it widens out. So when you start the freezing area here and the skin turns white, you want this entire area to start expanding until the frozen periphery here is about three to five millimeters in circumference. You want to make sure you get all the way down to those deep layers, uh, kill the wart, and then a hematoma or small area of blood forms underneath the wart and literally pulls it up towards the surface and the what people call the roots or the, de the deepest part away from the deepest layers. And that's the quickest way to get rid of a plantar's wart. In the office, cryoblation, usually two to three days of discomfort. What I tell patients is you may hurt to walk on the area, but you can't hurt it. So there's really no restrictions and you can control the pain with a Tylenol or anti-inflammatories like Aleve or Advil. Otherwise, return to the office in about two weeks. We nip around the edge, remove the top like you would a normal blood blister, and nine times out of 10, it's healed up underneath. If there's any other small areas, we may touch them again with the liquid nitrogen uh, to make sure we got it. Otherwise, uh, very, very easy to get rid of. Thanks for tuning in, and again, stay healthy and one step ahead.